Hello, students. Good evening. Hello, hello. It is a pleasure to have you here. Welcome to another day, another class, another opportunity to learn. Thank you very much for being here. Sorry for the delay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I was just finishing the other class. But I am here. Hello, Joanna. Hello, Claudita. Hello, Marielos, Lorena. Hi, teacher. Hello, Anna. Hello. Welcome. It is a big, big happiness for me to have you here and for sure to have the opportunity to have another class with all of you. I sent you a little message today about uh, the activity that we were going to do with the holiday. I hope you have had the chance to actually do it. And thank you for the ones who were sending it at the moment. Alejandro is not here yet, but he was one of the first ones sending it. That was very nice. Well, so uh, here I am going to uh, share my screen to start our day. I really appreciate you being here. <clears throat> Let me see. I have a message. Okay. Don't worry, who said there? Let me see. I have a message, let me read it. Okay, <laughs> you will survive, don't worry, Lorena. Don't worry, Lorenita. You will survive with your, with your internet. I am surviving as well, so you will do it. Well, I um, asked you yesterday, yesterday, today in the morning, to, uh, investigate about a holiday and the different activities that you are going to do on that holiday. So the idea is that you choose a celebration and you tell me what is going to happen on this celebration. Yesterday, we were working on that. We were working on different days of the week and different activities that we were going to do during these days. We have the best and los what's working right and the idea was that you were going to write some sentences escribieron las oraciones que les correspondían acerca del otro grupo que se los enviaron ayer yes, en el whatsapp <laughs> ok I need yes. some examples right necesito algunos ejemplos de las actividades que el otro grupo iba a hacer what do you have as examples ¿Qué tienen de ejemplos de su otro grupo uh, okay, um, Maria. Uh, day Friday. Uh -huh. um, I am going to draw the homework. We are going to go to the school. And she is going to make a cake. She's going to make a cake. Very good, very good. Another example from a different day. ¿Qué otros ejemplos tienen? del grupo contrario uh, the best the best are going to clean the house good. on Thursday very good um, and the best are going to watch uh, on watch um and teeth. Uh, ah, to brush their teeth. To brush, brush their teeth, teeth right? To watch yeah. is to observe, right? To watch, right? But to brush, to brush, to, uh -huh. to brush, to brush oh. their teeth. Good. What else are they going to do? What else are the other people going to do? Ahí les mandaron que iban a hacer todo. Tomorrow, teacher. 
Ajá. Eh, ok. Eh, tomorrow I am going to... I am going to drive for grandmother house. Okay, to drive for your grandmother's house. That is a personal example, right? Very good. I am I am going to I am going to go with my mother. I, I am going to visit 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 yes. beside no visit visit. visit. Okay. I am going beside. Uh, no, I am going to visit. I am going to vis uh, visit my, my grandmother. Uh, we are going to cook uh, there. Uh -huh. um, we are going to make uh, uh, quesadillas. <gasps> Really? Wow. <clears throat> bueno, ya vamos, va, for, vamos a mandar for, mi ubicación. For, for <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's very nice. That's pretty awesome, right? You are going to cook quesadillas. Nice. Good, good, okay, good. Um, to cook, cook. To cook. Or, no, in that case, you say, we are going to prepare quesadillas. Porque si, si ustedes las van a hacer desde cero, you are going to prepare. To prepare. Yes. It's not correct to uh, say uh, make. Yeah, it is correct. It is correct. Like we're going to make some quesadillas, right? Okay. But in some cases, when you start from zero, si empiezan desde cero y ustedes hacen todo, you say, we're going to prepare. Okay. Nice. Uh, then uh, we are going to come back. Uh, we are going to... Uh, Spend, no, uh -huh. yeah. pay, pay or spend, uh, buy, ah, I, we are going to buy uh, melcochas in San Esteban, Catarina. <laughs> you are going to buy melcochas, melcochas are very famous there, wow. Mm. Uh, that's it. And that's it, right? Thank you, yeah. Juan Carlos, for sharing excellent examples of the real life, right, about what you are going to do. Okay. Nice job. So here on the example that I am sharing with all of you, and I think you can see it, I have a special occasions, right? And I have different celebrations. And for sure, with different celebrations, I have different activities. Here, I have a lot of verbs that are related to activities that you do during these specific days. And you have, for example, the first one, send cards, enviar tarjetas. Number two, uh, give presents. Okay, give presents. Nowadays, you don't send cards, right? Ahora creo que ya no enviamos cartas. Ahora la gente envía gift cards. And so like, ah, oh, here you have a gift card for uh, uh, okay. whatever thing, for, for everything, for super select, for whatever thing. But you can, you can give a gift card. You can also give presents, that regalos, right? Take pictures. Tomar fotos. Yeah, se van a tomar fotos, right? Sing songs. Happy birthday to you. Right, that is to oh. sing song, right? Or, I don't know, madrecita querida. On Mother's Day, that's a very common thing. To dance, right? You are going to dance there. Boom, 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 right? Eat cake. Well, here in El Salvador, we eat cake for everything. Bautizo. Yes. Eh, el niño ni come pastel. <laughs> el niño ni come todavía. Es eh, cierto, eh, teacher. Porque, eh, bueno, al menos en, en mi caso, eh, se come un, como cinco veces al año pastel. <laughs> Incluyendo eh, Navidad y Año Nuevo. <laughs> You say, el Día Reyes, rosca, eh? and then you say, Mother's Day, cake, birthday, cake. For everything, you have cake. I mean, here in El Salvador, it's like, ay, eh, something like that, cake. So we celebrate everything. So that's something that we use, and that's very common. Have a party. In which cases can you have a party? 
in which celebrations for a Mother. wedding for a graduation for mother's day here in el salvador we also have parties for everything even for any specific celebration and you say hey you see this and this is going to happen party party <laughs> is that mira el niño se le cayó el diente party right like my background right now let me just fix it okay so that is to have a party right alex se me cayó otra vez i have i am losing my background sorry <laughs> se me cayó mi fondo <laughs> sorry <laughs> my husband is my fix it all el es el que me arregla todo thank you so give me one second i will fix my background um have a picnic in which cases do you have a picnic uh, mother. Mother oh, day. okay for mother's day very good for a graduation you can have a picnic eat a special food in which situations do you eat a special food okay for, a, for christmas for an anniversary mm -hmm. Okay, what else? In which other cases do you eat a special food? Birthday? For, for, a, for, for a birthday, right? Here in El Salvador, what it is considered a special food? ¿Qué consideramos aquí como comida especial? En el bautizo y la comunión. <laughs> yeah, exactly, right? For the baptism and for the first uh, communion. It's very common. What is the top one food for celebrations in El Salvador? Pupusas. <laughs> Pupusas. Panes con pollo. Panes con tamales. pollo. Tamales, right? Pollo or, campero. Pollo campero. <laughs> pollo campero and pizza hut, right? They, they are like the top one, right? Cumpleaños. Vamos a ir a la pizza. Sandwich. Oh, oh, for piñadas, right? For piñadas, you have sandwiches and horchata. Mm. Right, horchata sandwiches and a choco banana. That's for every single party or ice cream. Right. Pero el que se lleva todas las, las porras aquí, el pollo guisado. Pollo guisado es como el top de todo. 15 años, hagamos un pollo guisado. Un pollo en recaudo. Like the Christmas thing, right? So with, like, with rice, with yeah. rice and salad. <laughs> And potatoes. And, and fresh and salad. Green salad. Green salad, exactly, right? Green salad, rice, and chicken. That is like the top one food for uh, parties That's here. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> apple salad <laughs> as well, right? That you have this, this type of apples and potato salad. That is the top one thing in El Salvador. And wear a special clothes. Uh huh. Cool. Perdón, ¿cómo se diría sopa de gallina? Ah, well, that is a hen soup. I will send okay, it to es you. Es que eso normalmente, en, por ejemplo, chalate, en lugares que son, o sea, que no son propiamente de la ciudad, eh, se tiene la costumbre de sopa de gallina. Yes, in the countryside. All the parts of, well, most of the places in the countryside that is, but that is a delicatessen. I mean, that is a top thing. That if you go and they make hen soup for you, it is like, we kill the hen just for you. So you have to feel special, right? So it's like, no, para cualquiera matamos la gallina. It's very specially made for you. It's like, you see, ahí la chonita le engordamos todo el año. ¿Por qué vas a venir? Y la chonita, yo qué culpa tengo, right? <laughs> <laughs> but they they have the the they have this special meal for people right and it's very delicious i have to admit it right todas las sopas de gallina que las hacen cualquier abuelita de cualquier lugar del salvador que no es san salvador are very delicious they are very very delicious and i sent it on the chat right the hand soup and wear a special clothes. In which cases do you wear very special clothes for the I celebration? On the anniversary. On the oh, anniversary, on graduation, on the yeah. wedding, on Mother's Day, 
right? Father's Day. On Father's Day as well, right? But mostly for the wedding and the graduation, right? Because you have to wear a special gown to go and uh, participate of this, right? Good. So based on this, that is basically what I ask you to do. I am going to send you to work in little groups and you are going to share about your holiday and the different activities that you are going to do that day. Okay? Todos ya tienen su festivo y qué actividades van a hacer en ese día. Si no, choose one. For example, in Mother's Day, I am going to send cards. I am going to invite my friends to a party. I am going to eat cake. I am going to do this and that. That is the idea, right? On the groups, you are going to talk. Okay, my holiday is uh, Halloween, for example. I am going to have a party. I am going to eat cake. I am going to dance. I am going to ask for candies. I am going to have a family party, etc., etc., right? So that's what you are going to do with your group, okay? You are going to go and share about your holiday and the different things that you are going to do that day, okay? Any question, my dear class? ¿Alguna pregunta, chicos, antes de irnos al grupo? No. No? You have your presentation ready. Ah, okay. Let me see. I am going to make the groups. You are going to have only four friends on each group. And there you go. Okay, I am going to make it five. Here we go. Good. So accept my invitation to go to the groups and share about your holiday, okay? You are going to share about your holiday and you are going to share about the activities that we are going to do that day. Let's go to the groups right now. Okay. Chiche, perdí la invitación, me la pueden mandar otra vez. Ahorita. Gracias. Ahorita, ahorita. Ok. There you go. Ahí se le enviará. Marvin, did you get the invitation? Arabella, did you lose it again? A saber por qué me trajo para acá. Okay, I am going to send it back. Gracias. Don't worry. Don't worry. I will send it back okay. to you. I... Oh, Marvin is at work. Okay, okay. Good, 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 good. Don't worry, Marvin. Thank you very much. I am going to go and check Marvin, the other groups, and I will come back in a moment, okay? Don't worry. Preguntar o así. No, ahora yo voy a decir. Ah, oh, ok, ok. Bye. My holiday, de, my holiday is Mother's Day. We are going to have a special lunch. We are going to cook. We are going to decorate. We are going to invite friends and family. We are going to dance. And we are going to listen a special music. And we are going to take pictures. And we are going to eat cake. Nice activity. Very good. Good, good. The next one. Okay. Another holiday Christmas. Uh, we are going to go to house. We are going to eat bread with turkey. We are going to share with our families. 
We are going to talk with our family members. We are going to drink wine. Why? We are going to dance on family. And you are going to dance with your family, right? For Christmas, you are going to eat turkey, right? That's so nice. Very delicious. Yes. Excellent. Continue, please. Who's next? Mm -hmm. Claudia o Janet, faltan. Oh, Claudita dice que solo puede escuchar. Solo una duda. Es yeah. sobre la... Uh, About the la, audio. La, la actividad que nos hizo el día de ahora, ¿verdad? Yes, it's about the audio, about the holiday. Yes, yes. Ok. Um, holiday day, cho, chorizo day. Activities, uh, we are going to go to the Central Park of Cojutepeque. We are going to share with our friends. We are going to eat typical chorizo dicks. We are going to go to the park. We are going to the green soda and water. Okay, good. The chorizo. De you see, that's a nice, a nice celebration. I didn't know about it, but that's pretty mm. awesome. <laughs> no, <laughs> very good. Okay, uh, let me see. So most of you already finished. So tell me, okay, now you can continue talking, right? Ahora que voy a los otros grupos, se pueden quedar hablando de una celebración que no le gusta. So what is one celebration that you don't like? And it's like, I know, I don't like this one and this one because of the activities. ¿Y qué actividades hace la gente ese día que a usted no le gusta? So talk about it and I will come back in a moment, okay? Okay. Hey. Pero, ¿cómo, ¿cómo se pronunciaría? ¿Cómo se dice que se le... O sea, para decir que se le va a llevar a ella, ¿o cómo? Como, estamos, ya, como ya nos estamos refiriendo a la madre, uh -huh. entonces, cambio de look, nada más, porque ya estamos hablando de ella. ¿Diría? Ajá. Tenemos una duda, ¿cómo, cómo hacer esa oración eh, diciendo que le haríamos un cambio de lugar a nuestra sí, madre para sí. el Mother's Day? Yo sé, ¿quién, quién, ¿quién lo va a hacer? Ustedes la van a llevar, right? Sí. We are going to take uh -huh. her, we are going to take her or take our mothers, we are going to take our, her. our, porque son todas las nuevas mamás de nosotros, our... Oh. O U R, no. O U R. O. Ah, ah, o U R. O U R. O U R. O U R. To take our mothers. Quítale el U ahí. No, ese U no va. Okay, okay, okay. We are going to take oh. our mothers. Our mothers. Ajá. Uh -huh. Quítale el R porque el R ahí no va. Ah, es, we are, ajá, llevaremos a nuestras madres. Exactly. We are going to take our mothers, plural. Mothers. To the salon. To the salon. To the salon, yeah, to the salon. Good, we are going to take okay. our mothers to the salon. Yeah, without the uh, stress mark, because in English we don't have that. Remove it, please. Okay. 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 Uh, uh, in the word salon, you don't have to put the stress mark because in English we don't have. In English, no hay tildes, right? La O no lleva tilde. No. In no. English, no tildes. Salon. Uh -huh. Salon, just like that. Uh huh. And the same thing here. We are going to decorate. We are going to decorate. Surprise. Okay. Surprise. We are going uh -huh. to. We are going to, you can say, we are going to uh, create make. or to make. make, we are going to make. make. Well, in that case, the verb for that one is we are going to decorate the house. We are going to decorate the house. No, make it. Decorate. decorate. Uh -huh. No, you can use it. You, we house. are going to decorate. We are going to make, de de decorate the house. No, no, no. We are going no, to decorate. Ah, okay. Si sí, 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 decimos, okay, okay si sí, decimos, we are going to decorate the house, vamos a decorar la casa. Okay. 
Okay, we are going to decorate the house. Good. We are going to cut uh, the their favorite favorite, favorite food here. No. No, we are going to listen. In this case, you say we are going to cook their favorite. And I am going to send it on the, ch on the chat. Ah, pero de, de ellas. Exactly. Porque están no. hablando de las mamás. We are going to cook their favorite dish. El dish. platillo no, favorito de ellas. Ahí se los envié en el chat ahorita. We are favorite going to... dish. Yes. Ir de shopping. <laughs> go on. Spanish English. We are going to go shopping. We are going to we are going to go shopping right we are going to go shopping we are going shopping we are going to go shopping okay continue now you know it we are, we are going to give did you finish finish Okay, tell me some examples. A ver, Eli, give me your example. Eh, menciono. Give me your general, example. Lo que dijo cada uno o solamente. No, no, no. Your example. No. El tuyo. Es, um, my my holiday is Christmas. Eh, I am going to go a visit family. I am going to go to visit. To go a visit. No, visit. a visit, no, I am going to go to visit family. Or I am going to go visit family. Okay, or you can say, I am going to visit family. I, I am, am going, going to, visit to, to visit family. Okay, porque cuando decimos, I am going to go to visit, voy a ir a visitar. No, y si decimos, I am going to visit family, voy a visitar a mi familia. So it's easier, right? It is a little bit easier for uh, for you to say it. Go ahead, continue. I am going to eat a special food. I am going to eat a special food. Very good. I am going to, to share with my family. With your family, uh-huh. I am going to drive to go shopping. I am going to drive to go shopping. Voy a manejar para ir de compras. Uh-huh. Yes. I am going to drive uh, to go shopping. Yeah, that's okay. Uh -huh. I am going to drink coffee, soda. I am going to play video games. I am going to play video games. Very cool. Carlos Alberto, give me your example. Uh, my favorite holiday, uh, Independence, Independence Day. Independence Day, yeah, for sure. It's your teacher's birthday. <laughs> Lo puse como como we are, verdad? Como que vamos, mi family. We are going to go at the Salvador of War Monument. Okay, al Salvador del Mundo. We are going to have breakfast. We are going to follow the route of the parade. Of the parade. 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 We are going to tell and share with our friends and family we are going to return home you are going to return home okay so as you are going to return home we are going to return to the main room let's go back salgamos de aquí y vamos a Welcome back. Welcome back, my dear class. Okay. Tell me, did you have the same holiday with a different person? Coincidieron en que tenían el mismo el mismo festivo en el grupo? Sí. 
Which one? Sí, teacher. Uh, con el I, Christmas. Christmas. Hey, that's a favorite sí. one. Sí. Christmas is a very famous holiday. Which one do you prefer more? Christmas or New Year? Um, Christmas. For Christ me, Christmas. For, uh, yeah, Christmas is like more family thing, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And New Year is like, yeah, se acabó el año, que no que, que no cuando. Yeah, yeah, it's more like a party thing. But Christmas, Christmas has a meaning, and that's that's like the good thing. Christmas has a meaning behind, and that is like the beautiful part. Well, before everything, I am going to call the attendance. Okay, le voy a pasar lista antes que nada suceda. Alejandro Jovel. Present. Thank you very much. Ana Elizabeth. Present. Thank you. Eh, Arabella. Present, teacher. Carlos Alberto. No. Eh, Carlito. No, but Carlito. Ah, yeah, he's here. Carmen Vanessa. Claudia Iris. Esta cosa me está fallando, pero here, present. Don't worry, Carlitos. I got you ready. Don't worry. Carmen Vanessa, Claudia Iris. Claudia Iris. Eh, Denis Eliseo. Present teacher. Eli Antonio. Present. Eneida Verónica. Present teacher. Janet Rosibel. Present teacher. Jennifer Alexandra. Joana Damaris. Present teacher. Juan Carlos Cubías. Present. Liana María. Present teacher. Lorena Saray. Marvin Neftalí. Marvin was here, but he's in, he's working. Odalia, Odilia Suleima. Odilia. Raul Antonio. Raulito. Ruth Mariela. Here, teacher. Thank you. Sandra Georgina. Silvia Lisset. Present. Thank you very much. Okay, so let's go back to uh, our main discussion. So you were telling me that you had the same holiday with a different person, right? Eli and Marielos had the same holiday for Christmas. Uh, Dennis, which was your holiday? Can you tell your class a little bit about? Mm. Eh, nosotros elegimos el día de la madre, Mother Day. Okay, you were in group, right? You created in group. Can you tell us a little bit about? Compartanos en qué quedó su, su veredicto. ¿Qué van a hacer el día de la madre? Uh, ya, yeah. permítame. Uh, don't worry, don't worry. Uh, ¿Lo puedo ir leyendo por uno? Please. We are going to serenade here. We are going to prepare. No sé si se dice. Prepare. Prepare. A breakfast. To prepare breakfast, uh huh. Uh, we are going to take our mothers uh, to the salon. Okay. Uh, we are going to take them to the salon. <laughs> Good. <laughs> we are going to decorate the house. Uh, we are, we are going to cook the, their favorites. Dish. Favorite, 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 favorite dish. Uh, we're going to go shopping. We're going to give their present. We're going to take picture. We're going to listen to music. Uh, and we're going to drink orange juice. You are going to drink orange juice. That's very important, right? <laughs> cool. Not any type of drink. Orange juice. 
Good. Very good boys. Very good girls. Excellent. Don't worry, Claudita. Don't worry, Claudita. We understand that you're having a lot of issues with the internet. Okay. Arabella, which was your holiday? My favorite holiday is my birthday because birthday I, birthday birthday yes birthday uh, because i am i am uh, going to the the party with my family and and wake up very early of the uh, repair and uh, dresses, uh, dress beautiful. For sure, you have to dress beautifully <laughs> the day of your birthday, right? Que se note el cumpleaños. Yes. <laughs> um, um, I am going to the get lunch with my friend and I am going to the get dinner with my family. Okay. I am going to get to the get? No, you say I am going um, to get. Okay. I am I going, am going to, get to get dinner get. with my family. Very good. Excellent job. So you see, holidays and activities that you do on each holiday are very easy to express, right? You don't have to complicate that much on, hey, I have to do this and that and blah, blah, blah. No, it's so like, okay, I am going to do this, 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 and this, right? And it's specific, right? You have to go specifically on the different activities that you will do. Here, I have one example. And these are kind of the questions that I made for you. What is the holiday or festival? It is the one that you express, right? Todas esas preguntas las respondieron ustedes con lo que ustedes hicieron hoy, esta noche. What is the holiday or festival? You say, my holiday is Mother's Day. My holiday is Christmas. My holiday is New Year. When is it? When do you celebrate your holiday, people? December 25th. December 25th, right? December 25th or May 10, June 17, right? What are you going to do? It's all the activities that you describe. Ahí sí, yeah, todas okay. las actividades, todas las que describieron. I am going to eat cake, I am going to have a party, I am going to dance, I am going to, well, in the case of uh, all the mothers that are going to go to the salon, right? El grupo de, de, todas las mamás van a ir al salón de belleza que Denis nos estaba describiendo. So, That's so nice. Imagínense que cuatro o cinco de nosotros nos juntáramos y diríamos, va, llevemos aquí a que nos enchulen a, a, a mi mamá. Y allá van todas las cinco señoras al salón. ¿verdad? That would be a fantastic idea. They would be like, ah, all the day, right? They will enjoy it. Believe me. Who is going to be there? My family, my friends, my sister, my brother, right? Cuando tenemos la pregunta, who's going to be there? It's like, ¿quién va a estar ahí? ¿Quién nos va a acompañar? So, and you describe it. Y ustedes mismos lo hicieron. With my family. We are going to go to a restaurant with my family. I am going to take my mother to church. For example, right? When are you going to go? For Mother's Day, for my birthday, for Christmas. How are you um, going to get there? Quizás esta es la última que no, no se las incluí, salían cómo se iban a ir, right? How are you going to get there? By bus, by car, by Uber, by taxi, walking, okay? If you take, if you take your mother to a restaurant, okay? Imagínense que llevan a alguien a cenar, ya sea su mamá, su novia, su amiga, etc. How do you take the person to the restaurant? ¿Cómo, cómo se van? Do you drive? Do you take the bus? Do you call you a taxi? Right. You drive. drive. <laughs> you, do you call in drive or Uber? So. Drive it. Okay, you drive. That's so nice. 
So, how are you going to get there means that. ¿Cómo van a llegar? ¿Cómo se van a ir? Okay, that is the meaning of how are you going to get there. And here you have the example that I had you doing. Este ejemplo que está aquí es el que yo les pedí que hicieran esta noche y lo hicieron excelentemente bien. That was a very good exercise. A clap for you, people. Very good job. I was visiting the different groups and I was listening to you talking and expressing, right? Here, I am going to show you one example of people who do things on their birthdays. And I have, what is the name of the first person? People. Okay, ahorita nos vamos a enfocar en este primero. Right? This is the only important one right now. Okay? Let's face on this one. What is the name of the person? Elena. Elena Buenaventura. Elena Buenaventura, right? Where is she from? Madrid. Madrid. How is the complete Madrid. sentence? ¿Cómo sería eso en una oración completa? She is from Madrid. She is from Madrid. Okay. Madrid, España. How old is she going to be? How old Before. is she going to be? He, uh, she is 24 years old. She is 24. No. ¿Cuántos años va a cumplir? Ah, How old is ah, she going ah, to be? 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. 21. Is the holiday. ¿Qué día es el cumpleaños? What day is the holiday? Saturday. On Saturday. Saturday. Okay. What is something? What is something that they do to celebrate the birthday? She's going to go out with her friends. She's going to go out with her friends. Good. Tell me, what is something specific that people in Madrid do when you have a birthday? Some people pull on the hair use. Pull her ear. Uh -huh. Do you know what's the meaning of pull her ear? Let me just remove this. Pull her ear, yeah. <laughs> that is pull her ear. Uh... On the ear. On. 21 times. One for each birthday. Imagínese el que celebra 50 en Madrid. My God, la oreja caída por aquí. A ver, ser así como cuando nosotros hacemos la malteada que decimos. Exactly like that. It is la a cosa. tradition, right? It's a tradition. <laughs> or the horrible tradition from El Salvador. Imagine that you have the cake, right? Este era mi cake imaginario. It's like, happy birthday to you. Pastelas. <laughs> and they put <laughs> cake I'm on sorry. your face. I hate that. <laughs> and they say like, or they push your face on the cake. And it's like, guacala, después uno come pastel ahí con pelo y todo. You, right? So, but in Madrid, what they do is that they pull on your ear. 21 times. They say that some people do it only one time. Hay gente que ya lo hace solo una vez, pero sus amigos are very traditional. So they are going to pull on the ear 21 times. So let's read it. Let's read it. And it says, listen first and then you repeat. Okay, ahorita solo van a escucharlo y después lo vamos a practicar. Let's do it. My 21st birthday is on Saturday, and I'm going to go out with some friends. To wish me a happy birthday, they are going to pull on my ear 21 times, once for each year. It's an old custom. Some people pull on the ear just once, but my friends are very traditional. Okay. Sin encender el micrófono, repeat after me, okay? My 21st birthday is on Saturday. 
My 21st birthday is on Saturday. Don't open the microphone. Usted solo háganlo ahí, usted solito, vea. Ah, ya lo había repetido dos veces. Pero it's dele. okay, it's okay. So you say, my 21st birthday is on Saturday. And I'm going to go out with some friends. To wish me a happy birthday, they are going to pull on my ear 21 times. Once for each year. It's an old custom. Some people pull on the ear just once, but my friends are very traditional. Now, abran el micrófono y pregúntenme por alguna palabra que no sepan cómo pronunciarla. What is the meaning of ear? The ear. Uh. The ear. Tu oreja. Any other one? Or that you don't know the pronunciation? What is the meaning of pull? Pull. Jalar. Pull on my ear. Huh? Oh. Once, teacher. Once. Once. Okay. So, once for each year. Una vez por cada año. Once es una vez. Okay. And the cost, what is the meaning of custom? Custom. Tradición. Costumbre. Cost. It's an old custom, you say. Una vieja costumbre. Okay. No more questions? Pronunciation questions? No? What is the meaning of wish? Wish. Wish. Desear. Desear. Wish. And now you understand the song, like, we wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you. Te deseamos, right? But in Spanish, we say, we wish you. No, we say, we wish you. We wish you. A Merry Christmas, right? Christmas, yes. Okay. Practice with sure. me. Yes? La, entonces me dijo, bueno, se me olvida. Esa palabra que dice que la leo once. Once. <ríe> ah, once, once. Me voy a acordar del uno. Once. once. Eso tiene relación con, con traditional. Eh, no. No, en this case no. You say, um, once for each year. Una vez. No, no, cada... perdón, perdón. La, la, quiero ver, quiero ver. Ah, custom. No, la, la custom, custom. No, no, no. Custom is a. Eh... Una vieja costumbre, right? Mm -hmm. When you say, my friends are very traditional, es que mis amigos son bien tradicionales. Que ellos siguen, pues, lo que está ya marcado, vea. My friends are very traditional. Ellos son muy de, de orden. But they are related, right? En alguna manera sí están relacionadas. Because they follow the tradition. Siguen la tradición o la costumbre. Good observation, Carlos Alberto. Very nice. Go with me. My 21st birthday is on Saturday. My 21st birthday is on Saturday. 21st. 21st. My 21st birthday is on Saturday. My 21st birthday is on Saturday. And I'm going to go out with some friends. And I'm going to go out with some friends. To wish me a happy birthday. To wish, to wish me a happy, happy birthday. birthday. They are going to pull on my ear 21 times. They are going to pull on my ear 21 times. 21 times. To wish me a happy birthday, they are going to pull on my ear 21 times. Once for each year. Once for each year. It's an old custom. It's an old custom. Some people pull the ear just once. But my friends are very traditional. 
but, but my, my parents, 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 parents are very traditional. Now, let's go with the girl here. What is the name of the girl? Yan Chin Chi. Yan Chin Chi. Yan Chin Chi. Yan Chin Chi. Okay, Yan Chin Chi. Okay, yeah. Bueno, para en algún lugar de Taipei, un, un, por ejemplo, Federico is like, oh, what a strange name. <laughs> Yan Chin Chi. Where is she from? Taipei. Taipei. When is her birthday? Tomorrow. 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 How is she, how old is she going to be? Sixteen. Sixteen. Good. 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 What is she going to do with her family? Ceremony. A ceremony. Very good. What is she going to receive? What is she going to receive? Money. Money. Get some money. Money, money, money. Right? She's going to receive money. And what is the name of this present? Lucky. Lucky what? Lucky envelopes. Lucky envelopes. Very Lucky good. Envelopes. Okay. What is she going to eat? What is she going to eat? Noodles. 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 What is the meaning of noodles? It's like spaghetti, no sé. It's so, so. Como... <laughs> no sé. Fideos. Fideos. Very good job, noodles. right? Noodles are fideos. Mm -hmm. And what is the meaning of noodles? What do they believe that it's the a meaning long, of noodles? A long life. A long, a long, long life. life. Like the noodles. Mm -hmm. Black. Noodles are for a long life. Okay, so Yan Xin Shi, Taipei. And she says, Tomorrow is my 16th birthday. Go ahead with me. Tomorrow is my 16th birthday. It is a special birthday. It is a special birthday. 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 It is a special birthday. It is a special birthday. Special birthday. So we are going to have a family ceremony. So we are going to have a family ceremony. I am probably going to, sorry, I am probably going to get some money. I am going to get some money in lucky envelopes. In lucky envelopes. envelopes. From my From relatives. My... From my relatives. relatives. I'm, I'm probably going to get some money in lucky envelopes from my relatives. I am probably going to get some money in lucky envelopes from my relatives. My mother is going to cook noodles. My mother is going to cook noodles. Noodles are for a long life. Noodles are for a long life. Noodles are for a long life. Very good job. So, uh, any question about this vocabulary that we have just studied? What is the meaning of envelopes? Yes. Envelopes. Sobres. Yes. Sobres. Mm -hmm. um, lucky. Envelope lucky. Lucky. Lucky envelopes son sobres de la suerte. Lucky no. envelopes. For sure, right? If you receive a, las, a, an envelope las, full of money. Uh -huh. Las dos palabras significan lo mismo. Una sola. O lucky significa una cosa y envelopes. Uh, okay. Otra. Lucky is de la suerte, right? Luck means suerte. Lucky envelopes is like eh, sobres de la suerte, right? So that is the meaning. Lucky is suerte, suertudo, right? And envelopes are eh, sobres. The name of the present is lucky envelopes. What is the meaning of long? Long okay. life. Larga vida, right? Larga vida. Long okay. life. 
¿Y cómo son los videos? Largos. So no. that's why they eat noodles, because they are for a long life. Representan una larga vida. So those are the noodles, right? Those are the noodles, and that is what they represent. So my dear class, let me just move a little bit around here. We are going to start, right? Thank you very much for the reading that we have for the class. For tomorrow, we are going to, to work a little bit on the parts of the body, but I wanted to make a short introduction to it, okay? Here, we have a picture with different parts of the body, right? We have a picture with different parts of the body. We have the head, the eye, please don't say ages, right? It's eyes. Eyes. The ear. The ear. ¿Dónde, ¿Dónde escuchamos esta palabra este día? Ear. Chica sí. oreja. En la anterior presentación donde le jalan las, la oreja por cada año cumplido. Exactly like that, right? They are going to pull on my ear, right? The nose. Su nariz. No. The nose. No. The mouth. The mouth is toda la boca, right? Mouth. No. Mouth. Tooth is only one. Solo uno. Tooth. Teeth. Ah, and tooth. teeth are teeth. all of them. No. Tooth okay. is solo un dientito. Only one. Mm -hmm. And teeth. teeth. To toda la sonrisa, right? Teeth. No. Chin. No. This is your chin. Barbilla. Tu barbilla, right? La quijada. <laughs> tu barbilla. The wrist. The wrist mm -hmm. is this part of your hand, right? The wrist. Mm -hmm. La muñeca. Don't say the doll, right? Ay, mamá, I, I have a pain on the doll. No. <laughs> wrist. Wrist. The arm, right? Um, the arm. And the arm. arm. The elbow. El <laughs> Please. <Ay. laughs> Please. When someone when someone is exactly what you are thinking, it is not elbow. It is called a stingy. A stingy is like agarrado codo. Stingy. But elbow is the part of the body, right? It's like prestame un dólar. No carga. <laughs> okay, the throat is this part of your body, right? The throat. throat. El, la garganta. La garganta, throat. right? Throat. The neck is this one at the back. De ahí viene el dicho que el de me van a dar en la neck. Me van a dar en la neck. Now, now everything makes sense, right? The back. Tu espalda, right? Back. The shoulders. Y ahora comprenden. Ahora comprenden el nombre del shampoo. Head and shoulders. <laughs> Para cabello corto o largo. Head and shoulders. <laughs> the back. The chest. The chest. Para un hombre, para los hombres es el pecho. Right? The chest. For a lady, it's the breast, right? I am going yeah. to send it to you on the chat. The breast. Para una mujer, su pecho es breast, and para un hombre es chest. The next one is the stomach. Stomach. No es stomach. Es stomach. 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 The thumb. The thumb es este dedo gordito, right? The thumb. The hand, the hand, the hand, hand and the mano. fingers. Fingers. The fingers. 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 Estos son los dedos. Fingers. Y solo este se llama thumb. Thumb. Y ahora entienden por qué es el thumbs up. Thumbs up. Ah, thumbs up. Ah, dedos arriba. Good. Ah. Hasta ahora. ¿A los cuántos años? So, thumbs up. And <laughs> here we have the leg. <laughs> la canilla, dicen por ahí. 
la pierna de leg. The knee. The knee is su rodillita. La que se arruinó jugando fútbol y por eso ya no juega. Ya vieron, ya vieron. Ahí sí nos fregaron. The ankle. Ankle means tobillo. Uncle is tío. Uncle, tío. Ankle, tobillo. Right? Foot es solo uno. Uno de sus piecitos. Foot. Feet, los dos. El plural de foot es feet. En sus deditos de los pies es toes. Ok? Toes. So, this is a very quick, quick introduction. Tomorrow I am going to give you more details about the parts of the body. But now you can remember and you can think about them. So, my dear students, I think that's all for today. It has been a great pleasure for me to serve you. And for sure, get ready for tomorrow. We are going to talk about the parts of the body. And uh, we're going to have a very fun class tomorrow. So, have a great night, and I'm going to see you tomorrow for another class. Bye, teacher. Bye-bye. Have a blessed night. Bye-bye. Bye, teacher. Take care. Bye. Have a good night, teacher. Have a beautiful good night. night. Teacher.